Why hello there everyone and welcome back I'm your host today Mr. Mobile and today we've got ourselves a brand new map, a collaboration map perhaps, what? A collaboration map perhaps by cause here. Now it looks like before we go any further I would like to mention that it was created by the Alliance Studios beyond creative with the support of Alliance Studios. And yeah, this was the hub. Now, if you notice there was like a wee bit of time gone, that's because I ran around seeing if there was any quests or anything. Unfortunately, there's not. And the other thing which I noticed is that sliding isn't enabled. So that's, that's, that's awkward, yeah. But the closest thing to a quest was, well, I thought it might have been this guy, but no, he's just a thing that opens the store. Uh, I wasn't planning on buying the skin in the first place. But there is a maze here, though the maze is kind of rigged because, like, you can literally see your mini-map. And if you run all the way around here to the other side, through here... Actually, you could have went through that next one, but if you go through here, you go through here. You go on down to this next tree. This way, not that way, the other way. And then you can continuously go round and 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 round. By the way, the entire time I didn't even look at my character, I was looking at the map. But that just brings you up to this large statue of these props. Yeah, and you. Oh, you can actually stand in the shoes of this one. Most of the custom props in this you won't be able to really go up close to for some reason but yeah that's all that's in the middle here doesn't seem to be any little easter eggs or anything in it either but then there's this model here but you can't jump on them you just slide off them you can't you can't get up on the head either and then you have that that this here just leads on to the me as yes but the water here when you jump into it it teleports you here so I think there is a wee bit of parkour where you can jump across to here, hold on, you jump across the, there, there you go, you can open your glider and then jump across to here, and you can stand in this, seems a bit pointless, but uh, you can if you really really want to. But notice though that it has turned to night time and they have used the buildings, like the background buildings, which is nice. I wonder, is that getting smaller? Or is it just a long path? We're going to have to check that in replay mode. But then, lastly, also I really like that they've made these like art pieces. I think that's really creative. But yeah, lastly, in this here building, we've got some sort of art gallery. Personally, not my type of art. You know me, I'm an artiste. And uh, yeah, this, this definitely ain't my kind of art. You can't even go into this white box here. It's completely solidified oh you've got this little guy again you can't even jump on him you've got all the pieces of art i presume it's this cause guy's art that one there is not too bad actually but you've got like a couple going down here on a stick the stick snaps and now he's covered in blue goo from portal but yeah you don't even need to do the maze because you can literally see these ones up close here you can't stand in the shoe on this one but yeah, you can literally see it right there. Got some bigger pieces of art. I mean, at least you don't need to pay to get into this gallery. But besides that, that's everything. I do like that little exit sign up there. I'm pretty sure that's a custom exit sign. But yeah, it's not a bad hub. It's not my favorite, but it isn't bad. I really like those custom 360 cameras too. I just wish there was a quest because... Every hub we've got so far this year has had a quest. And like all of winter we also had quests in them all. But eh, I guess it is what it is. But let's go into replay mode and see if we can spot anything hidden under the map. Okay, here we are. We'll let our player run around and all. Um, we'll close this and we'll speed a wee character up here. Now we can move around. Now first of all, what's the back of this look like? Oh, there actually isn't anything on the back. Though that's an interesting detail, putting that bit of thing on the roof there. Maybe that's just because copying and pasting simplicity. I'm not too sure. Didn't even realize these roofs. These are nice roofs. They've got like the circle trick going on there that does look really weird out here. With like the bumps and stuff. 
but it looks good on the inside. We've then got like the giant statues and stuff. The maze. But I wanted to see, is the path getting smaller? It is. It isn't getting that much smaller, but it is getting smaller. And that's what you call everyone an optical illusion. It makes it look really far away. But it isn't that far away. Like if you see that, that's about one floor wide. And then if we go up here, it's about two floors wide. So it does slightly get smaller. And you can kind of see the lines going together there. That seems to be everything around the outside. But what about underneath the map? Will there be anything under? It does not look like it. No. Except for this random thing. Why do they always have these little, like, floors? I don't get it. Why do they always have those in hubs? But that seems to be everything, everyone, in the hub for this week. If you enjoyed, why not subscribe? It's completely free. And you can unsubscribe at any point. And why not like as well? If you like, the like button will turn to a color. But anyway, I'll see you all in the next one. And as always, goodbye.